Good morning. Today is Thursday the 1st of February. It's good, isn't it, to have January behind us, to hear the birds singing as you walk around and the snowdrops blooming. Yeah, we're that much nearer spring. Did you take part in the big garden bird count last weekend? I haven't at the time of recording, but I intend to. And I'm just hoping that the squirrel doesn't come and pinch all the food I'm going to put out and that the variety of birds I see during the week all happen to come and land in the one hour I'm watching. That would be good. The Bible mentions several birds. Owls, ostriches, sparrows, ravens, pigeons and doves to mention just a few. My favourite verse talks about eagles' wings. In chapter 40 of Isaiah, verse 37, we hear God's comforting words to his people. He hasn't forgotten them. He's giving them hope. We read, But those who trust in the Lord for help will find their strength renewed. They will rise up on wings like eagles. They will run and not grow weary. They will walk and not faint. If you've ever seen an eagle soaring high in the sky on the thermals, you'll know what a glorious promise that is. And perhaps often in our Christian life, we could do with that uplift and which we get as we trust in the Lord. Jesus uses the humble sparrow to teach us how special each person is to God. Matthew chapter 10, verses 29 to 31, we read, For only a penny you can buy two sparrows, yet not one sparrow falls to the ground without your father's consent. You are worth much more than many sparrows. And in Matthew 23, verse 37, Jesus describes himself as a mother hen that gathers her chickens under her wings. As he looks at Jerusalem, he says, if only you knew how much I long to put my arms around you, but you wouldn't love me. We can let Jesus put his loving arms around us because he's always willing to do that. Oh, just a few bird references out of 300 in the Bible. I hope you enjoyed them and found them encouraging. We pray. Thank you, Father God, for the wonder and variety of your creation. Help us to play our part in caring for it. Amen. God bless you all. Have a good day.